It's a special day of the month, and we're here with Deb Lee, who is the executive director of the Council on Aging. Deb, good morning. Good morning. And tell us what's going on here today. Today is Food Bank Day. Every fourth Friday of the month, we do a distribution of food to seniors, 60 and over. Um, they fill out an application, and the Boston Food Bank provides us with all the food, and they come down and, and pick up their stuff once a month from 11 to 1. Now, how long has this been going on? This is the third time. We started in March, and every fourth Friday of the month, they, we started out with 24 recipients, and as the applications have increased, last month there were 48, and this month we're serving 60. They're also serving at the same time at Trip Towers, 78 people. So there's lots of folks that are signing up for this, and, and it's a great way to stretch your budget. And uh, no cost whatsoever. You just have to fill out an application, be 60 years or older, and you can get those at any of the senior centers. Well, um, a person needs to be on, I would guess, a fixed or a limited income to be eligible for this, right? There is, a, there is an income, uh, um, yes. Parameter. There's an income parameter, yes. Okay. And what is it that they get? We're going to probably take some pictures of it, but... You get quite a bit. There's, uh, there's always a two-pound block of cheese, and the cheese is great for baked macaroni and cheese or anything you want to use it for, grilled cheese. There's canned vegetables. There's um, juices, um, instant potatoes. Everything is non-perishable other than the cheese. And so um, pasta and rice and peanut butter and, and a great way to stretch their budget. Um, I'm, I'm not familiar with this um, organization in Boston. This is a state-sponsored thing? It's, it's the Boston Food Bank in, in Boston, yes. Um, and they, they do the application process. We send the applications to them. They notify the recipients when they've been approved, and then they send us a list each month of who's going to be picking up. Well, that, that's really good. And this all gets done within a period of actually two days, right? Right. It comes a, in? It's, it's actually comes in, came in this morning. Um, it's unpacked and uh, they come in boxes, so there's two bags to a box. Um, one bag is a lot of vegetables, the other bag is a lot of juices and pastas and, and also the, the, the cheese. And um, my staff unpacks the boxes and gets it ready for people to come on in and, and now, pick now up Now you said stuff. vegetables, you mean canned vegetables, canned right? Canned vegetables, wow. everything's canned. The, the wonderful thing about the food bank is everything is grown in the United States. So okay. this is all United States food farmers in, in the United States that produce this, this food. So. That, that, that alone impresses me that uh, it, it happens. I think we need to tell people where we are and what they need to do if they want to take advantage of this. Great. Um, our administrative offices of the Council on Aging are located at 181 Hillman Street. Um, you can call us, we can mail you an application and then you can drop it back by uh, to us because we have to have a proof of identification. and. Um, if you want to stop by any of the senior centers, either, either um, Buttonwood, um, Brooklawn, Hazelwood, or Ashley, they'll have an application for you. Um, you could do it that way, or just give us a call, and we'll, we'll make sure you get an application and get it sent into well, Boston. Let's give folks the number, because I can put sure. the number up right on the screen. That's okay, it's 508-991-6250 is the main office number. Okay. And they can ask to speak to you or to any one of your assistants? Actually, the person who answers the phone is the, our actual um, receptionist is the one who's handling the application process. So he'll make sure, Robin, that you get an application and it's sent out. That, that's great. I, th I think it's one more piece of evidence of the work, great work that you're doing to help our New Bedford area seniors. But that was a good question. I said New Bedford. It's limited to New Bedford. It is New Bedford. This is New Bedford. A cushion it also has their own pro um, um, program as well as Dartmouth and Fairhaven. Okay. So yeah, currently it, this, is, this is just New Bedford. Yeah. Well, I know that we're going to have a rush of people coming in very shortly and uh, we'll take some pictures of them picking up their, their food. Good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.